First week is the oncology patients, and then the second week is their siblings. And they, they offer so much perspective in life. We, we come and we have a good time for two weeks, and that's pretty much what we're about, is letting these guys have a good time, uh, get away from the hospital and get away from the trials of cancer and all the appointments and things like that, to so just come out here and have fun and play and enjoy themselves in, in nature. And so that's, that's what we try to do most of the week. We keep everything upbeat and really high energy. My dad thought it was just a bone bruise, and then finally, my mom took me to the doctor and he sent me to get x-rays and then found it, and then within a week I was in there getting a box. I was diagnosed with leukemia in May of 92 when I was five years old, and I, I came to camp one year, was, I was kind of shy to begin with, didn't know that I really wanted to be here, and two days in, I didn't want to leave. I was diagnosed in 2001 with a brain tumor called Um After I went through treatment, I was told about Camp Horizon, and I've been coming here ever since. I think it's really a sign of hope because um, it gives kids a chance to see that um, they can still be a kid even though they've been through what they've been through. I guess it's kind of a place where you can actually relate to others that you kind of know. Well, they went through some of the sort of stuff they you went through, so. So I'm, I'm sitting here, I'm like, I don't know what I've got myself into. And then these kids start telling me these stories. They start telling me about, you know, what they went through, how they struggled, and I just kind of took a step back. And uh, I thought, like, these are the real heroes. I got diagnosed in November, so this is my first year. Um, you just get to take everything off your mind when you're in pain. Um, I work at Camp Horizon because I know it's something that's actually working. I know it's something that's actually helping um, uh, little kids and older kids as well. Um, I work at Camp Horizon because I know that they actually benefit from it, and also because uh, it, it makes me feel good too. A lot of the counselors are former campers because a lot of them had cancer. A lot of them came to camp in the past, and um, so you know to see the kids who are on therapy, being able to interact with ones who have finished therapy, um, you know, come and be normal people, to be normal kids, to do normal camp activities is, um, I think, actually very good therapy. You know, they don't have to worry about anything because they don't have, you know, IV drips following them around all the time and they're not hooked up to all sorts of machines. They can go make s'mores or they can shoot bow and arrow or go catch crawdads and fish in the pond and all sorts of stuff. And, it's just great. They forget about everything while they're I just let it sit there for a minute, then I had a bite, then I just reeled it in. The time here I spend here will be with me for the rest of my life. And no matter what, the experiences I have from here will help me in the long run. I know if you donate to American Cancer Society, you may not see where your money goes. You may not see the difference it makes, but I do. And I want you to know that what you do changes lives because it has changed my life forever.